Okay, yeah, kind of freaked out. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm like, what the hell is that sound? Creepy. I wonder if you could see me. <laughs> what are the chances? We never close this little blind thing. We usually have it open. <laughs> hey, good morning. How was your sleep, baby bear? She kept waking up last night. What the dealio? Funky. That funky monkey. Huh? Hey, monkey, uh. monkey. <laughs> so just Juliana and mommy hanging out in the bed. So she yeah, she she kind of sits up now. Again, we're searching for breakfast at a little convenience mart. And they have no shortage of food here either. This is not 7-Eleven today, but still have it. Oh yeah. This is what we got. We got some miso soup. Got some milk. I haven't had Holy milk in a while. Is it still, oh, still crispy? It's all right. Yeah. Um, and then I got, oh, that's just rice for that one. We got some salads. Can you help me out here, honey, please? Juliana's like, help daddy out. Um, that's some miso soup. Got some tea. I got some natto sushi right here. Ooh, oh that one's mine. And then look, I got salad dressings too. Let's let's eat. There's no shortage of quick, delicious food in Tokyo. This is basically this, covered in a sweet egg mixture on top of rice with onions and delicious, delicious. What is this? Like I said yesterday. Oh, where was that sauce packet? Shoot. Dang it. When you're in Tokyo, don't be afraid to just go into stores and taste food. Whether it's a quick, uh, like a convenience store, or a store that doesn't even look like a restaurant, just walk in. People are pretty nice, try to point at things. Today is our last day in Tokyo. Well, we're leaving tomorrow morning. We figured that we would just pack early today so that tomorrow we could spend time with Obachan. And hopefully OG Chan will come out to breakfast too. So Juliana's still in her jammies. We're watching Beyonce. Uh, we were scheduled the photo shoot for today and I'm like well prepared now. I did my makeup a little heavier so it could catch on camera better. Uh, let's see, we have about two hours left and we're gonna give Juliana a bath. I think, I think it all worked out for the best anyway. When we found out that the park was closing, Juliana was basically asleep. So she just woke up from a nap. Um, I think she's pretty well rested now, so come 3.30, she'll be okay. Beautiful. And beautiful. We're here at the park again. Deja vu. We have the same clothes on. And you have to buy tickets to get into this park. But we're here before 4.30. Better get this shoot done. Uh, Juliana oh, right is awake. She's just a little tired. I'll push. I wow. you vlog. No, I want to push. It's fine. I can vlog and push. I'm a woman. I could multitask. Alright. See where we can find them. The, was it them that called you? Oh, I think so. Wow, look, some of the trees still have the sakura. 
I don't know if that's the same cherry blossom. Yeah, I if these are something gigantic. Oh, that would have been so beautiful. Juliana, do you see the beautiful flowers? Yeah, over there. Now I know how my mom feels. I remember when my sister and I were little girls, she would take us to like parks like this with my family. And my sister and I would be like, oh, so boring. And I wish I was here like two weeks ago. Right when, oh my gosh! <gasps> we gotta go there. That's this where pond we're supposed is to beautiful go. too. <gasps> Look, there's even a little bridge. Honey, it's so we cute. It. Let's see the flowers on this tree. We have a central rest area full of yummy goodies. Oh, these are the mochi with bean inside. That would be a good gift. Oh no, she picked the wrong one. Aw man. Oh, poor lady. She's so cute. I'm gonna get some milk tea. This one looks good. Tea's Tea New York. Thank you. Let's see how this Be works. Careful, um, your teeth. You said your teeth were My good. teeth are turning yellow. You know, just for the picture, we might want to find a straw. It's so windy. A sakura hit me in the eye. <laughs> oh, <dude. laughs> Man. Yeah, Juliana's still a board bear. Not too impressed. Shoot, video. Wait one second. Oh my gosh. Tell me, you guys, this wouldn't be a good picture right here. Oh my gosh, she's smiling. We could probably take some still shots just I'm from this so and it'd be so like, good. The nap was totally worth it, having her nap a lot earlier. Oh yeah, this is such a beautiful park. I believe is one, it's not necessarily open to the public in the sense that you can just walk in freely. It's actually uh, limited in time and also you have to pay. So they probably have a budget to be able to take care of all these beautiful plants. I just come and sit and relax enjoy these very old large beautiful trees the water obviously if it's the right season cherry blossoms look at that amazing <laughs> this little boy's been pursuing Juliana <laughs> Hey there, buddy. Yeah. Hey, cutie. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> and it's windy, and there's beautiful trees everywhere. Photographers here. Hello there. Hi. <laughs> You're already in the vlog, right? Oh, oh at the meet and the, greet. On the meet and greet. This is Caitlin, everyone. Hi. Hi. Can you do so She's gonna be helping us today. She offered her services. Oh, it'll be fine. I like your shoes. Thank you. Did you get those here? Ross. Oh, Ross. Gotta love it. She got it at Ross, everybody. I Computer on a tripod. <laughs> it's got its own software and everything. We just wrapped up the photo shoot. It's awesome. Julio, you're awesome. I can't wait to see the photos. Juliana really acting up and obviously she was tired so she's knocked out. She's KO'd. We got recently. We just got kicked out of the park, so we're gonna bounce, but it was good. I was I'm glad we came today because um Julio and Taylor were saying that the trees just blossomed overnight. Like I think there were just two trees that were blossomed yesterday and now all of them are. 
half an hour before the park closed, they play really sad music, and I guess it's common here in Japan. It's kind of like a way of saying, okay, go home, even in department stores. <laughs> Oh my gosh, this is, yeah. And this is not that early. This is a That's the fast way. <laughs> uh, we couldn't find elevators around here. This is the hard part about having a stroller. We don't even know how to get her through. Oh, what about this? Oh my gosh, how are we, how are we gonna get through? Is that a gate over there? No. It's a closed gate. Okay. Where will I meet you? Okay, I'm gonna wait by Hach Hachita or I forget the dog's name. But this is a famous dog. Hach Hachi um, waited for his owner at the train stop where he would wait for him every day after work. But one day his owner never came home. And it's because the owner died. <laughs> There he is. There's an actual movie on it where Richard Gere was the dog owner. Oh, there he is. Oh, tourist. <laughs> What's his name? Hachiko. Hachiko? Hachiko. Hachi. No. Hachiko. Oh my gosh, this is too awesome. Check it out. <laughs> Only in Japan do you see that. But of course it was a foreigner using it. We were contemplating whether or not we should bring this City Mini GT, but now that we've been using it in Tokyo for a while, I definitely would not recommend this for <laughs> no. Tokyo unless you just want to be annoying to other people and you want a headache. I would definitely come here and buy a tiny, just, just smaller buy. stroller, They're really small umbrella ones, here. Um, because you know this is just too big. Either that, or if you have a baby Juliana's age or smaller. Oh, yeah. Just um, get the baby carrier. Yeah, you can buy one here too. So. We bought one here for like 30 bucks, and, and I really like it. It's yeah. easy to use. If you do end up bringing this, just so that you can use it at the airport, I think that's fine. But just don't bring it on the train. Not in Tokyo. The trains are just crazy. Uh, packed. Okay, we're looking for somewhere to get a small bike. You could always rely on the bottom floor of a department store. And this today is not half as crowded as it was. It's a ton. Oh, the baked goods. Let's go to food food. Alright everybody, so we're here at the Tokyo Food Show in Shibuya. Oh yeah, oh yeah. And over here we've got uh, we got salad. We've got a lot of vegetable selections going on right here. And I just like you guys to know if you're in Shibuya, stop here. Tokyo Food Show is the best. Mm -hmm. Look at this fruit right here. It's such a cute coffee shop. People are so classy. Drinking their tea. Some hip hop music in the background. You love that, baby? We got some coffee here at Capital Coffee. We got some asparagus salad tomato salad, onigiri, and then I think this creamer. I'm here as a break to be Juliana, and uh, waiting for our friend Satomi, and we're gonna have curry after this, but you know, Judy should be the Godzilla. So we had to feed the Godzilla. This is a snack that sometimes you get in the States from my Obachan, but you have to refrigerate it, so I'm not exactly sure how they get it, but it's these raisin sandwiches. They are so good. In fact, they're so good I bought a whole box because you can't just buy it individual. I'm gonna eat a whole bunch of these. <laughs> Cream, raisin, the bomb.com, baby. A cool thing about the streets of Tokyo, they give you free tissue. And they're everywhere. People just handing out free tissue. Shibuya 109, one of the most popular shopping malls here in Tokyo. If you're into, uh, it's it's all girls' clothes basically. Ah, uh, the cutest. 
Tommy's here again. We're gonna go shopping. I already see very cute kawaii clothes. I haven't gone shopping at all except for a jacket. And I think that's all I bought clothes-wise. So I'm gonna get some cute stuff here. Here we do see cute stuff. Oh, how cute. That's what the Shibuya girls look like. Uh, let's go upstairs. Okay. Yes. So that's basically what all the shops look like. Just fun girl clothing. Oh, and look how considerate everybody is. You leave the right side for those that walk to walk up. And if you just want to chill like Satomi and I, you stay on the left side. This mesh, I love the color. Seriously, the best. Second one. You gotta watch out for these because the cream is pretty heavy and I think they as well, the raisins are like packed with sugar, but delicious. Yeah! Ooh! Ba 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 ba! Na 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 na! No 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 no! Ah. <laughs> I'm sorry, little one. I found some awesome cute clothes. This is what I'm getting. I love this denim. It's like a. Can I show what you're wearing? Yeah, it's so cute. It's like bringing 80s back. <laughs> Thank you. On another floor is the store that's more spunky. And then you have your romantic clothes right across from it. This is a uh, typical Shibuya style. They all wear bangs, have bangs. Wow, that's different. I bought, oh look how cute she is. The materials here at Shibuya is lower quality. So a lot of it you see are like teenagers shopping here. I was asking Satomi, I said, do you, do you shop here? And she said, no. <laughs> Never. Yeah. I guess she did consider it like lower end Forever 21 or something. But stuff is so cute. Even if it's just temporary. Even more false lashes. As Satomi likes to say to me every time I see false lashes, she tells me, don't look. <laughs> Because I, I waste my money on these. So tell me, don't look! <laughs> don't look, Judy! <laughs> oh, and these sell um, circle lenses. You could just buy it over the counter, but there's no prescription in them. There's Daddy! <laughs> oh, she was sleeping. <laughs> when? Just right now, for like 20 minutes. Did she eat? So, well, I tried to Oh, she's just tired. Screaming like the loudest I've ever heard. <laughs> I totally remember the store. In fact, I bought a pair of bangs here last year that I probably only wore like once or twice. At the drugstore, there is a drugstore at the bottom of 109. And I'm looking for Kate Cosmetics. It's what, um, people recommended that I try. It's a Japanese brand. Kate. Where can I find Kate? Oh, there's Revlon. Did you find? No? Oh. Oh, Matsumo. Mm, yeah. I heard Ken Make is good too. Actually, Asahi likes Ken Make. This is my first time seeing Barbie makeup. What the easy? That's so cute. <laughs> New Barbie face mask. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, cool. Look, a food truck. Donor? Oh, yeah, donor. Okay, we got Jenny and Tommy here. And we got a, a boy band in the back. I don't know if they're still there, but we're going to go eat curry, or as Benji likes to say, curry. 
here. So tell me thought uh, <laughs> Indian curry, but we want Japanese curry. It probably is not better than mine. <laughs> so I don't know how Benji is. Oh, he's behind the boy bend. <laughs> oh. Finally gonna eat kare. I guess this is well known right here. And they've got all these different options. You can get uh, different types of eggs here. It's gonna be good. Obviously toppings for puccine to get. Let's say pickled cucumber. Some like cayenne cayenne pepper and then right next to it is a little skull dangerous hot sauce is that gonna hurt me in the morning you die you die you die oh yeah little one she did so well today other than the 20 minute uh, DQ moment at the mall that she gave daddy are you guys sick of seeing Juliana yet? A lot of Juliana vlogs. <laughs> she got fat while she was here. Usually people uh, don't get fat in Japan, but she got fat off the formula. She's a little tubbo right now. Baby's job though, eat and cry. <laughs> Curry. Interesting what they do is they take the ground beef and they spread it on top of the uh, rice And then they put the sauce on the side and then I got this called toro toro egg Which is like half boiled egg, but I'm not exactly sure how they do it. I think they may poach it I'm about to put this hot sauce on it. I should be careful not to touch my eyes after this And the hot sauce is not that bad Amazing amazing mm. Mm, 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 mm. This curry was so good and I guess this restaurant is so well known that SB, this company, actually teamed up to make this guy's curry. Amazing. If you guys ever get the chance, come here. It's kind of a small place but looks like it's family owned. I don't know what this is but like they got the, a beer, a pub, a Japanese pub. Look, they got things on tap over there. This is totally my place, man. Totally my place, honey. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is the place right here. It's right next to it. Have curry. Have curry. Bistro and Belgian beer. Oh my god, this sounds so good. And there's a Japanese guy in there. His face is so red. Must be really, really wasted. Biggest coincidence ever. We're right about to cross the street here in Shinjuku. <laughs> or Shibuya, sorry. And we run across the Sahi. Hi. Hey, that's a cute baby. <laughs> Are you going home now? Yeah. This is sad, bittersweet. We have to say goodbye before next year. Until next year again. Oh, I know. The tears come. The tears. Uh, this time we introduce another baby. Maybe we'll have a second one next year. <laughs> Who knows? I don't know if you guys know, but Satomi is the first one to ever give us a baby gift. <laughs> she got us a pack of diapers, like a small pack of diapers, when we when we left Japan. Little did she know we were pregnant then. We, I didn't even know. She knew. Yeah, she knew. She yes. <laughs> If you're wondering if you're pregnant, ask the Tony, <laughs> and she will she'll let you know. I know everything. <laughs> yeah, she knows everything. I'm gonna miss you guys. Let's go to fucking <laughs> inside joke. Oh, Juliana. He's giving us a random kind of gift. Funny. What is it? But you, I'm pretty sure this drunk guy got it, stole it off. Oh my god! Like, what is it? <laughs> this, okay, this what says, does it say? Tadaima Egyotu, meaning it, we're open. Tadaima? Oh, it's an yeah. open sign. And this means like we're getting ready right now. So I thought it would be good for like your cooking video. Like, oh, it's <laughs> authentic! So awesome. Thank you, What's Jenny! <laughs> Hey, little one. 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 Little one.
pretty good. Cry, you're crying, crying. Cry, you're crying, crying. Hey, you're not crying. Who's your name, Juliana? Who's your name, Juliana? Who's your name, Juliana? Who's your name, Juliana? That's a little overwhelming, huh, baby? Who's your name, Juliana? Who's <laughs> <laughs> your name, Juliana? <laughs> Goodbye, Tokyo. One last time. <laughs> Bye, Tokyo. <laughs> baby, <laughs> actually, you're supposed to say sayonara. Sayonara. We're packing up now. One. So we got one bag down. I could try to have... fit in there. Two and a half more to go. This is a oh, duffel. We're, we're just gonna end up checking it in because it's gonna be heavy, full of stuff, anyways. Uh, think of everything here. Well, this is probably one of the reasons why I even did it. Look at Wes's wallet. It's got a what? coin dispenser. It's like something like a, 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 a railroad person would have, right? You know, like or like somebody that gives out change a lot. I mean, that's like pretty that awesome. Yeah. Um, Why is this all, oh, it's, it's old. It's yeah, the, the one downside is if you're the type of person that puts this in your back pocket, yeah. the weight of your body is gonna crush the metal against the zipper and ruin the zipper. Uh, that's my own yeah. thing, but if you're a person who carries a bag or something like that, yeah, it'll stay nice forever. My wallet is like, it's like the wallet that goes inside the wallet. Uh, okay, right? okay, it's just, just a flat, just a, the, just a little flat. Okay. Because I, I, I actually feel like uh, I don't want too much there because I've heard it could actually it messes up your back. back. Anyways, they think of everything here. Totally. Signing out. And you might see a uh, YouTube channel. Peace. I'm thinking about it. <laughs> <laughs> We're quite sad. We're to take a photo shoot at this beautiful park, but they close. At Look who's the saddest. 30. Oh. <laughs> what park closes 4.30 in springtime? Anyways, so.